Hey everybody, today I have an exciting free tool to share with you that will streamline the way you create slideshows from your photos. I'm often asked if there is a quick and easy way to create a slideshow from all the photos in a folder on a person's personal computer. Since not everyone has the time or ability to spend hours manually selecting and arranging pictures for presentations or videos, I've created a free utility to do it for you. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use a free program I've made with Python to instantly create slideshows from all the photos in a folder on your computer. Before we dive into the tutorial, make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so you won't miss any upcoming videos. To get started, you do need to download the autoslideshow.exe file from the GitHub link in the description and I'm going to place this in a folder that I have already prepared for this tutorial. It's a pretty small file, it's just about 30 megabytes, so it shouldn't take long depending on the speed of your computer and your internet connection. And now if we take a look at the folder that I've prepared, you can see we have the auto slideshow utility that we've downloaded, and we have four other picture files. We have another subfolder that also has some pictures in it, and we even have a subfolder nested inside that subfolder and that's fine the auto slideshow can work with all of that so without further ado let's double click on the auto slideshow utility and I'll show you how it works you might get this warning that Windows is going to try to block the auto slideshow you can choose to run anyway and you should see a terminal window open up and it's going to ask you just a few questions before it starts the slideshow. First, it wants to know if you want to play it on a loop, if you'd like it to just keep playing from the beginning every time it works its way through all the pictures, choose yes. I'm going to say no so we can see it stop when it's done. It's going to ask if it should shuffle the order of the photos or if it should just play them in the order it discovers them. I'm going to say yes, shuffle. And finally, it's going to ask you how many seconds to keep each image on the screen. I'm going to choose three just to make it move quickly for the tutorial. And at this point, the slideshow has begun in full screen. And as you can see, it's working through the photos and changing once every three seconds. And as soon as it's done, it's going to stop the show and close the slideshow tool. And that's it. That's the end of the slideshow. And that's all there is to using the tool. Anytime you'd like to use it in another set of pictures, you can re-download the program file from the link or just copy and paste it into any folder on your computer and run it to start a slideshow with as many photos as you have in that folder. I've tried it with folders with hundreds of photos and it works fine. If you have any questions about using the tool, please let me know in the comments. I hope you find it useful.